I'm the coach. You're locked into the NFL on EA Sports. Straight ahead, we've got what should be a good one between the Miami Dolphins and the Indianapolis Colts. I'll be back with you again with scores around the league at halftime. But kickoff right around the corner. And standing by to call the action, here are Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. All right, Coach, thank you very much. It's the National Football League presented by EA Sports. Just as we were ready for air, it was the Colts emerging from the locker room to great fanfare here at Indy. They're ready to go as the Colts get set to match up with the Miami Dolphins. With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. And Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. quarter let's see how this defense does on this drive come on set 18 Gator. 53 get in the way Five. on first and 10 Henderson escaping the pressure right it won't be a sack but it's no gain and it brings up second down well, there was pressure all around him, so the only play was to try and get out of there. I think it was an excellent effort by him just to get back to the line of scrimmage. Set, ready? Eight, three. Push him back. Push him back. Step. Looking to throw on second down. Henderson caught by Allen. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Dolphin first down. As far as tight ends go, this guy's not a speed burner. He's much more of an inline blocking type of a tight end. But how about this last play? Made a nice catch and picked up a first down. That's what impresses me about him. When he's called upon, usually gets it done. Two. On first down, Henderson. And he hits his target. It's Kenny Stills. We got this. And he'll work it across midfield inside the 45. And now here's a timeout called by the Colts on the defensive side of the ball. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Throwing on first down. Henderson eluding the pressure right. He's going to take off with it. He'll wind up getting nine after tucking it and running, so it'll leave him with second and a yard. Here we go. Eight games. Looking to throw. Henderson buying time to his left. He's going to take off with it. Five yards on the scramble, and that's enough to pick up the first. 60 outlaw. Off play action. Henderson flushed out right. He's going to take a shot for the end zone and nearly picked it off. He had a chance to come down with that in the end zone, but it'll wind up just being incomplete. Here's second and 10 now from the 29. To throw again. Henderson flushed to his right. And now he's going to use his legs. And he's able to get it to the edge of the red zone at the 20-yard line. The improv act there, good for nine. And now they'll be looking at a third and short, third and one. This will be play number seven on the drive. Third and a yard. Back to throw. Henderson dancing to his left. 
He may try and run for this. And he gets the first down yardage before he's brought down just outside the 10 at the 11. A good decision in the end to pull it and run, get some nine yards at a first. Check, check, check 41. Got nothing to Hey, Henderson escaping the pressure right. He'll try and run it. And the stop will come inside the five at the four. The improv on the scramble there gets him six, and it'll be second down. Three nothing after one on EA Sports. Second and four. This is caught. For the moment, it's a touchdown, but multiple flags down, so let's sort this out. And yes, they want the points. Been a nice showing here in the first half for this defense. Will that trend continue? Time to find out. Off play action. Henderson eluding the pressure right. And got his man complete. And he just falls short down at the one-yard line. A big play there on the catch and run. 74 yards. Well, that didn't take long. One play, and we're already looking at a first and goal situation. Flushed out right. Pressure here and taken down. A sack back at the seven. Now the Colts going to burn the second of their timeouts. That's their second, so they'll have one remaining here in this second quarter. We'll be right back. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Second and six. Flush to his right. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. Devontae Parker, the intended receiver. But now it's third and goal. A big play to start the drive got him in this position, but this defense has held firm since, and now it's third and goal. Forced out to his left. And this is going to be intercepted. Quincy Wilson with the INT. And the return won't go anywhere. They'll be back deep in their own territory. So a first and 10 coming up for the offense here in the second quarter. Let's see what this defense can do. On first and 10, Henderson rolling to his right. Got a man open. That's Devontae Parker complete. And he's going to be out of bounds right at midfield. 25 yards that time. 70, Indy. go. From the midfield strike, they'll look to throw. Escaping the pressure right. And he's going to keep it here. Give him 10 that time, escaping the danger, running with it, and picking up a first down. That was an excellent job of recognizing the situation. His first read wasn't there. Heck, his second read wasn't there. But he bought himself a little extra time scrambling out of the pocket, got to the sticks, and picked up the first down. He'll run it. He'll wind up getting nine after tucking it and running, so it'll leave him with second and a yard. Looking to throw. Henderson eluding the pressure right. Now he'll pull it down. And he'll be out of bounds, able to get it down to the 25 there. Maybe not exactly what they had in mind, but that scramble good for six and a first down. On first down, Henderson. Flushed out right. He's got Allen. And they will eventually get him down, but he's inside the five all the way to the three. Now the Colts will use their third and final timeout as the clock will stop with 34 seconds to go before halftime. First and goal, and they got to be thinking a chance to get right back into this football game. Now, meanwhile, a pass that should have been intercepted but it winds up falling incomplete. He was looking to get it to Parker again, but it'll be second and goal. They'll go again from the three here on second and goal. Flush to his right. He's gonna, and he will score. Touchdown, Miami. It's their quarterback.
Opening drive, third quarter, and we'll see how this defense comes out of the locker room. Off the bootleg, Henderson escaping the pressure right. And he'll be brought down by the Colts. Darius Leonard able to get in there for his second sack of the afternoon. And now here's a timeout called by the Colts on the defensive side of the ball. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. They'll come up after the sack on a second and 12. Here we go on second and 12, eluding the pressure right. He's going to take off with it. He'll end up getting five out of that, but now they're looking at third down. And for the Colts, an extra defensive back in there now on third down. From the gun, Henderson. Flushed out right. He can run for it, and he will. And he goes out right around the 39. Give him 10 that time, escaping the danger, running with it, and picking up a first down. Now that definitely hurts because the mindset is getting a three and out there, and they don't get it done. They give up the scramble and a pickup for a first down. Flush to his right. And now he's going to use his legs. Nice work to get seven out of that, and it's second down. Second and three. Steps away to his left. Now he'll throw deep left side. And he knocks the ball away, and it falls incomplete. He was looking for his tight end, Mike Kosicki, and it's third and short. So the incomplete pass on the last play, and that leads us to a third and three. Back to throw. Henderson, he may try and run for this. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. And they'll get him to the ground. He has another first down at the Colts 39. On third and short, not only did he get away from the rush and pick up a first down, he picked up a whole lot more than that. And how did he get it done? Evaded the rush, kept his poise, and then how about him directing traffic as he moved downfield to pick up extra blockers? A really nice run. Now a throw to the end zone on first down, but it winds up incomplete. The intended receiver was Jakeem Grant, but it'll be second down. And that's one he's got to be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there, need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. So line of scrimmage still at 39 on second and 10. Being chased out left. He'll try and run it. Oh, he's going to let this go for the end zone. And that's going to be incomplete. Good effort there, trying to take a shot, but it's third down. Here comes the eighth play of the drive, and they need a full 10 yards on third down. Operating from the gun, Henderson escaping the pressure right. He wants it all for the end zone, and it's knocked away and incomplete. Certainly looked like they were getting ready to convert there on third down, but what an effort to get his hand on that one, knock it away, and brings up a fourth down decision. On fourth down, Henderson eluding the pressure right. He can run for it, and he will. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. Able to find a lot of empty space there, picking up the first down at a 21-yard gain. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. Flushed out right, and he's going to keep it here. He'll get eight on the scramble there. It'll be second and a couple. I think the last two plays really illustrate how difficult it is to game plan against this guy because you know he can throw the football, but how about his use of legs as well? What we call those broken plays, you can't account for them. Yeah, those plays. Are... And he will score. Touchdown, Miami. They're more.
So a victory here for the Miami Dolphins. And I tell you, this was a fun one. Just a close game. Nothing comes easy in this league, as you know. They had to work for that victory. I've got to go back to what you just said. Nothing comes easy in this league. How many times have we talked to coaches prior to a game and assessed, you know, the strengths, the weaknesses, the whole deal? Even in games when one coach was a decided favorite, what do they always say to us? But you do know, this is really a seven-point league. Seven points either way usually decides a ball game. We had exactly that in this one. And not only that, but this is a gutsy road victory, one they can hang their hat on. So for the Dolphins, the win will help them keep pace in the playoff race as they move to 6-3 and three on the year. And they will head back home next week. Meanwhile, for the Colts, they'll lose an important one here as that drops them to 5-4 and four on the season. And they'll get a chance to redeem themselves at home next week. I'm Brandon Gordon. Certainly have to thank Charles Davis, my broadcast.